We're in the home stretch. 2017 is almost here. So it's time to talk about the hottest home decor trends for the new year. Tam Stone with Tam Stone Interiors is back and you have some fantastic ideas for what's trending in 2017, mm -hmm. starting with heavy metal. Yeah, I just returned from High Point Market about a month ago and saw everything that's going to be coming out um, in this next year. And one of the things that there are kind of five key trends that I saw and okay. what several of the design bloggers saw while they were there as well. One of them is this heavy metal. And this is the idea that foundry metals are being poured as huge accents on our furniture. So if you notice here, there's a couple of uh, pieces here on the right from Show Modern. And look at the handles on this cabinet. I mean, it has got these these poles on it, but there's hands that are cast that are uh -huh. holding them. And then also you see the cabinet below that has the metal with the fringe hanging off of it. And then the, the one up on the left is a um, Theodore Alexander piece, and the entire structure is being held up by a metal base. So it's not like you're seeing metal accents anymore. It's really being being a structural and a artistic decorative part of, of pieces moving forward in our homes. Even the, the fringe is more delicate, but yes. it's such a statement. Yeah, no, it's very so much cool. a statement. Yeah, definitely. The next trend you call clear cut. Yeah. What's clear cut? Okay, so we saw Lucite. Um, I think I even <clears throat> had this trend a little while ago, and you would see it more like you're seeing on this Dura Lee piece in the upper right, where it might be a leg or an accent, maybe knobs or something like mm -hmm. that. Now what we're seeing, um, including the Sterling piece, but also the two pieces, um, or the two sets of pieces from Thayer Coggin and Bernhardt, is that they are structural, again, part of the, the furnishings. So those Thayer Coggin pieces, actually the supports of the sofa and the supports of the armchairs are in this clear lucite, creating a very airy look and feel to your room. Mm. And then that Bernhardt um, bed is all lucite and just phenomenal. It just glistens when you see it. Which one do you think would withstand the test of time as far as trends go? Which one do you think would last you know, it's going to be more timeless. Actually, how all of those are executed, I feel like they do, and it's really the reason that I, I chose them. Uh -huh. um, the one on the, the left, the bed by Bernhardt, I mean, that's just a Hollywood glamour. If that's your style and you yeah. have that, that amp it up, you're going to always love that piece. I also feel like the modern pieces from Thayer Coggin can handle that clear structure yeah. and not look like it's out of place. It's not like it's a Louis XVI chair or something right. with loose sight legs. And then also on that Dura Lee piece, that's simple, it's subtle, but it, it allows the room to have an openness to it that you wouldn't have with wooden legs. It's striking. Yeah, it's really great. Really good, good looks. And family friendly is another trend, and that's yeah. nice to hear as a parent because the whole house is family friendly and rarely is it also on point style wise. Right. right. It doesn't right? look good it's usually. It's just a mess because you don't pick nice things when you have a lot of kids running around. Yeah, because you're, you you're afraid to. Okay, yeah. so I did a segment a while back with some Tebow fabrics from Krypton Home. I don't know if you recall, I think I did it with Lisa. We poured soy sauce on it and uh -huh. highlighter and everything all over it. Well, now all of the furniture lines are starting to introduce these family fam friendly fabrics into all of their upholstery. So if you're going out and you're looking to buy a new sofa or new chairs or something for your home, you're not restricted to just some ugly fabrics. They're really beautiful fabrics that are available in most furniture lines. Look for them and ask for them. Or also lines like Tebow actually carry them by the yard and you can reupholster your existing furniture for a fraction of the cost and have this incredible durability to it that um, is really wonderful. I put it on most, uh, any heavy duty pieces in all of my clients' homes and it doesn't yeah. matter what level client they are, I put this Beautiful. on there. Mm -hmm. Okay, two other items we have we wanna get to, striking sofas and mm -hmm. mix masters. So striking sofas, there okay. you go. Okay, sofas are changing and mm -hmm. what we've got here is um, two great examples of it. One is Century Furniture and the other is Ambella Home. Big, long sofas. For the first time in a long time, I have actually specced a sofa that's 110 inches long. To give viewers an idea, most sofas are anywhere from about 75 to 85 inches long mm -hmm. in this part of the country. So these long sofas are replacing what we would have had as sectionals. And of course, Beautiful. the one on the bottom here, the nice curved sofa. So striking silhouettes are coming out. It's just not your typical 84 inch squared off sofa and a couple of chairs. We're taking center stage with these different looks and, and different um, placement in the home. Show us the Mix Masters. Okay, so Mix Masters, I've done several segments where we've talked about silvers out and golds coming in and all uh -huh. that kind of stuff. Well, and I've often said, just mix the two together, but they've been in discrete different areas. So you might have lights that are, are brass, but you have hardware that's silver. Right. Now you're seeing them completely mixed into pieces. So
So this one on the right from Ambella Home is actually a standalone vanity, a beautiful piece that's got marble as well as chrome as well as brass all integrated into one piece. And of course, the other one from Show Modern, what you've got there is you've got the marble, you've got the stone, we've got the brass, and again, some of that great fringe that is similar to what we saw in their earlier console. So mix it up, and it, you're seeing them in the individual pieces. You don't have to yeah. do it yourself. They're mixing it for you. Yeah, exactly. Tam Stone with the hottest trends for 2017 to get us all ahead of the point.